wind, holy smokes. Sorry, this is a really bad gust of wind. <laughs> What's going on guys? Uh, just wanted to introduce kind of a new little series I guess that I'll be doing, um, that we'll be working on. Uh, basically, I'm really excited because we found a really, really great place uh, that might work out for the gym. I really like it. I know I keep saying that, but um, it's probably the best spot yet, and it really checks off all the boxes for us. Uh, it's got the tall ceilings. It's got the real open floor plan. It's got lots of parking. It's got. It's in a good location. The price is reasonable. Uh, we're allowed in there with by zoning laws and regulations. So everything's checking out so far, which is really good. It's been really difficult to find a space that meets all our all those requirements. So. I want to take you through and start documenting kind of our journey uh, towards at least pursuing this space because if it works out, it'd be a really cool series. If it doesn't work out, then I guess we won't have much of a series. Um, <laughs> right now, the process that we're right now we're in the middle or in the process of applying for the space. So filling out what's called a tenant application. Um, it's about eight pages long and it goes over a ton of stuff. They want to know like our financial position, you know, our savings accounts, our um, retirement account, our, uh, you know, the re projected revenue for the next two years, our sources of income, all this good stuff. Uh, plus we're submitting, I guess it eight pages of that, plus we're submitting a um, business plan, it's about uh, two or three pages, uh, condensed business plan that I've put together that goes over marketing strategy, it goes over um, opportunity in the market itself, it goes over, um, you know, target demographics, etc. So, our target audience. So, um, yeah, there's a lot that we're working on to submit that package. Once we get that done, hopefully within this week, we're going to send it over and pray that we get accepted to at least move forward. Um, after that would come negotiations and, uh, you know, a letter of intent that says that we want to do, here, here's like our terms, you know, do you agree? And we go back and forth with negotiating uh, least term, um, pricing, all that good stuff and various clauses that go into the contract. So it's all very confusing and there's a ton that's going to have to happen to make this work. So documenting it should be kind of fun and you can see kind of all the behind the scenes of what it takes to actually get this started. We've got to establish an LLC. Uh, we have to get insurance. We have to finish buying equipment, making big decisions and all that good stuff. So there's a lot to figure out. Um, anyway, just wanted to take you through all this. Um, we're looking at mid to late summer if this were to happen uh it summer's a really good time for us kind of lets us get some of the things that are coming up um event wise out of the way and it also gives us time to plan and save a little more and figure figure some last minute stuff out not really last minute but you know some final things out um it also generally friends and family are more a little more free during that time which would be helpful for us because we're going to need some help getting this off the ground uh, and our families and friends have been very supportive and we want to um, definitely take it, you know, be able to take advantage of, of the help that's been offered. So other than that, um, that's what we're working on. I'm currently starting to refurbish uh, some of our old equipment that we've, that we've been collecting over the past couple of years. We've got a whole bunch, a couple garages full of awesome stuff. So I'm starting the refurbishment process. Uh, so that's going to help us save a lot of money. I'm kind of finalizing. Um, an equipment list for what we need and what we want in the gym and still doing research on various other things like payment processing and 24-hour access security system and all that good stuff so there's a ton to figure out um yeah so basically like i said we're finishing up the business plan finishing up the uh tenant application kind of send that over and wait to see what happens um one more thing, uh, the plan is, one of the one of the biggest difficulties is figuring out what kind of interest level uh, the community has in something like this gym. And that's really hard to gauge. <laughs> so what we're gonna be doing is running a crowdfunding um, campaign, putting together a video, you know, explaining the whole uh, process, or not the, whole, not the process, but um, the vision, the, our mission, what our goal is, and uh, hopefully trying to, you know, sell it and, um, get some pre-sales going on memberships, maybe some merchandise, whatever, and see how it does. It's not really for the money, although that would help with, um, you know, upfront costs and everything, but it's more for determining the level of, of commitment, not the commitment, but the level of uh, 
interest, I guess, in the community. So which we, we can gauge that if it does really well, then we can be more confident in moving forward with this and pursuing this. If it does really poorly, we're gonna have to uh, <laughs> figure out what to do after that. We might have to think of, you know, reconsider. So um, I didn't say it before, but the space is uh, 6,600 square feet. Um, we might be going after half of it and then growing into the, uh, the second half, perhaps. We're going to think about that. Depends how the, our what level of interest we have. But um, 3,000 square feet is what we were looking for originally. Uh, this is a 6,000 square foot space. So that would be awesome to have the whole thing. But it's also really expensive. So we're going to see how it plays out. Keep you guys updated. Follow along. This could get really interesting. I guess it could get also really boring. So I'll let you know. <laughs> Stay tuned. And we'll talk to you later. So one of the tasks we have before us is refurbishing some equipment. Got this awesome industrial bench here. Got this nice T-bar row. Got a whole bunch. Got that bike. That bike's not going anywhere. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I got a bunch of sweet stuff that I got for real good prices. And uh, got to make them look nice. So the deal is, got to sand them down and get this. Uh, the head reel had a real smooth finish on it. So. Um, sanding it to kind of rough it up and then uh gonna wipe it down clean it all off gotta prime it and then uh, we're gonna spray paint it probably gonna go like all black and then i'm actually gonna redo the bench too i had to rip it off there it is it's in shambles um so yeah i'm gonna put the bench together get a nice pad we're gonna do three quarters inch plywood on um a nice high density foam and then uh wrapped in a nice grippy vinyl. It'll be a sweet, sweet bench press. I'm really excited for it. So yeah, we'll kind of walk you through this process and hopefully they turn out well. It's just doing a little drive-by of the uh, space. We'll get a more detailed look at it later. Um, I'll show you, but uh, yeah, basically, oh, what? They put up some sort of blinds. What's going on here? Check it. Yeah, you can see inside a little bit. So it's pretty simple um, look from out here. It's pretty cool though. Ah, sorry. Here we go. I think this is would be the side that we're on right here. So we got some like big building going on back there uh, behind that trailer, not that trailer. And then here's like apartments and apartments. So it has some good potential here. Um, basically, what's what's happening? We I sent over. The business plan, the eight page application, tenant application with all our financial information and everything. We sent that all, sent that all over to the agent who is um, like representing this space, represents the landlord uh, with the space. So she's reviewing it. We're gonna have a talk tomorrow on the phone, go over it. And then if she thinks it's ready, we're gonna send it over to the landlord for review so they can decide whether or not they want, either need more information or um, approve or deny our request to move at least move forward with uh, pursuing the space. So that's where we're at. Pretty exciting, pretty stressful. Um, yeah, this could happen. It also might not, so we'll see. <laughs> Stay tuned, baby. Stay tuned.